mom's name is Sarah. Oh, I thought that was gonna be a your mom joke. <laughs> do you remember me? Your mom. I'm just waiting for the Hulk to roll through, man. And just finish everything. This looks really cool. What? Sorry, Tommy. You know I wouldn't do this if I had any other choice. But he's my friend. So was I. Oh, uh, the feels. This is so bad. I hate that. That looks like me and you fighting over the last Pop-Tart. Ah, uh, they're fighting each other. That's pretty, that's interesting. That's interesting. That's different. How does this trailer make the movie look? It actually look kind of tight. It looks awesome. Makes it look badass. It makes it look so good. Really suspenseful and dramatic. A lot of fighting and Scarlett Johansson looking perfect and then some pretty attractive guys. So the plot here, is that the world wants to make superheroes register with the government so they don't use their powers without consent. <laughs> well, you did kind of destroy New, was it New York? That's a really cool plot. They easily could have done it superheroes versus the government and like that would have been cool, but this is like turning against each other. So all of the fans must be like, <gasps> The concept is really cool because after a while you just have so many people that are like, I'm a superhero now, like, let me destroy your city. It's like what we probably would do in real life because some people would love it and then some people would hate it and it's like, kind of like the war on guns we got going on right now. It's like, guns are their own superpower in a sort of way. If superheroes were a part of the real world, destroying parts of our cities and such, do you think you would want them to register? Probably. I think as citizens, you, you people would be freaking out. That's not fair for just normal people to almost like live in fear that the people that are like claiming to protect them are also simultaneously destroying their cities. I've always wondered, why don't they just take it somewhere else? Like somewhere in the middle of nowhere. I wouldn't want to walk out of my house and see like things blowing up, you know? I want to walk out and see like birds in the trees, not buildings falling. I don't think it's exactly their fault that the cities are being destroyed. There's also people that are coming to destroy it. Have you ever read comic books of any of these characters? Not very often, no. But I know like the origin stories of most of them. A little bit because of my little brother. No, I actually haven't. You know, my friend's like been trying to get me to do this, but I don't know, like I've never really had the time. Comic books over time have not been seen as being mainstream, yet if comic book characters appear in TV or movies, they become hugely popular. Knowing this, why do you think that reading a comic book is still sometimes seen as a nerdy thing to do? Well, that's, I don't know why that is, but it really frustrates me. Just the way our generation's going that we're so, I guess, lazy now. Reading a book is just too much work. The idea of reading something like science fiction, like in a book with pictures that people are like, oh no, that's for like little kids. But it's not. People get too lazy and they don't experience something new. So that's why they, you know, they wait for the movie to come out and they say, oh, like why read it when you can watch it? So last question, with the amount of superhero movies being made, which is a lot, do you hope it continues because you enjoy them a lot? Or do you think at some point they're maybe making too many of these? I think they should keep making them. Yes, please keep making them. Just go down the line and make them all. I think it brings joy and like happiness to a lot of other people, which is really cool. I think they should reach a certain point in the series and then once like someone important dies, like just end it because I don't want to see all my like favorite superheroes die. That would suck. I'm really liking like how they're switching stuff up with like the new Batman versus Superman. You know, it's like different. They're fighting. As long as we keep like switching it up and making it different, then I'm fine with the, all the superhero movies.